dominated. Uh, then kickboxers have had their day. You really need to be a versatile fighter and know the answers to everything, like uh, Mr. Bob Chanchin, uh, who's really got all the skills and has been able to really deal with all the different style of fighters, with the wrestlers, with the jujitsu fighters, and now a sambo fighter. It's really impressive what we're seeing here tonight. And Alex Semenov had to come an unusual route through the alternates route to get here tonight. And I don't know at this point if he feels like he's lucky or not. Yeah, he's definitely had a tough, tough fight here, fighting the champion, Igor Vavchanchin. Although he's tr 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 really clearly held his own. Yeah, he has. Nothing to be disappointed in whether it's a, he's a winner or a loser here tonight. Now we've got to be getting very close to at least a 30-minute time limit. I don't think it'll go any longer than that. As there he goes again. You see Semenov. The headbutt. With a, with a, seems like he was hitting him with his chin, <laughs> which that I've never seen because the chin is very susceptible to a knockout, to being broken, to That's knocking your teeth out. But these guys just last come minute. from every angle, <laughs> up, under, over. All right, they're calling the last minute of the fight. So we shall see. We've, we, I've been told that before. Man, these guys are unbelievable. The fans are loving it. The fans love it. They won't stop it. It looks like this one will probably go to the judges unless something miraculous happens in the next 30 seconds. Yeah, I don't... I. When the next guy has a really tough fight on his hands. I don't know how much longer they can have it either. They, they told us again it should be stopping at 30 minutes, which we should be coming up on any time now uh, because the next guy's got a final match. And if anybody wants any chance against Nick's Nutter, they're going to need a little bit of rest. Nick Nutter, of course, getting here the same day of the fight along with the other Americans and Federico Lapenda brings that contingent in and they come right from the airport right here. And the winner of this five fight, seconds to the end five of the seconds, five. by the way, left. Four, they count it down. Three, the winner meets two, Mr. Nick Netter one, of the USA. That's it. that's it. This fight is over. They're going to so stop the it and take it to the judges. Wow, what a superb fight. No, not one guy giving one inch, fighting truly to the end. Mr. Kalinke, please come to the table. Mr. Kalinke. Semenov is up and he is exhausted. Both men are exhausted. Yeah, they probably both lost about five pounds there easily. That was a superb fight by two superb athletes to go 30 minutes. Never will you see this in any sport. No, to go have no stopping to go continuously for 30 minutes. That's, abs that's 10 rounds of boxing with no breaks. So it's like 20, it's un absolutely amazing. What we, we are decided. going to overtime. A five minute overtime to decide because apparently this was a draw on the judge's sheet. They've decided to go to overtime. <laughs> oh boy. Can you believe that, Greg Friedman? Bob Chanchin is gonna wanna look for a quick knockout. He's been able, not been able to do it so far, but he's landed some big shots. Semenov just rolls with him though. He's really able, he's the type of fighter that can really roll with what you're doing. You punch, he rolls with the punch, so he doesn't take big shots. You shoot or roll, he rolls with you. A very smart fighter. Well, in all honesty, when I saw Semenov get up after the 30 minute time period, he looked like the more tired of the two. Yeah, I don't. Igor was much fresher, Greg. It appeared so to you, yeah? Yep. I, I would, I don't even know. I don't know. I know that he, he's definitely, uh, Vachanshin is the stronger of the two. So when you're competing against that, someone stronger than you, if you're not using your finesse, which he was, it became strength against strength at the end there because you're so tired to be able to use any techniques. Um, Vavchanshin had to use less strength. So we'll see what the difference here is. Both men again, we've seen this pattern throughout this fight very cautious as they circle each other. We are in overtime. In the red, Alex Semenov. In the black, Ivor Vovchenkin. And they are going to feel each other out one more time. And I look again, as I have so many times, you're gonna look for the Sambo man in the red shorts to shoot for the takedown possibly. And you're gonna look for a big right hand or a knee or something from Igor Vovchanchin. 
Yeah, those arms are just reacting now. You know, you mentioned something uh, that was very astute. And when you said that uh, 30 minutes, you know, continuous action, no place in the world, I, I would beg our, our viewers to just try to hold their hands up. Just hold them up for 30 solid minutes. Yeah. And they'll get very, very heavy in a very short period of time. Yeah, I mean, just, just think about your sports. Just think about even great professional athletes like we have in America, uh, whether it be wrestlers or, or, or football players or basketball players. Nobody does this hand-to-hand -hand combat. 30 minutes, that's truly, it's, I, I've never seen anything like it ever in the world. Out of the ring almost they go. The gate <laughs> oh, flies open. What a takedown. Semenov lifting up Avchanchin barely and throwing him to the ground. And he took a, a very big right hand coming yeah, he in. Did. I mean, he had to give some to get some, and that's exactly what happened. Big right hand. As both men go to the ground, Vavchanchin on the bottom. In the half guard of Vavchanchin, of course, Alex Semenov, who might be resting after that shot. Man, I, I felt that, but rattled my feet, my shoes. You'll see Bob Johnson trying to dig in that choke. But I don't know, I don't think he could do it from here. No, it doesn't look like uh, he has quite the leverage he'd like or the position of the head that and, is necessary. Yeah, or the strength this late in the fight. Yeah. We are in our 32nd minute. Both guys really letting it all hang out here. I mean, your arms are just you're just they're just hopefully just going off what they're supposed to do because you can't even tell your body very much at this point what to do you're trying to tell your arms to go and your head to butt and your legs to shoot but it's just you have nothing left truly truly warriors well conditioned Semenov trying to get in there boy and he's got a nasty gash that has really open blood flowing from his forehead now yeah you can really see that start to flow off into the, hopefully that doesn't get into the eyes of Avchanchin. Or Semenov. <laughs> Semenov, you can bet it's, 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 it's already affecting him. You can see Avchanchin holding him tight, resting those legs up, not wanting really too much to go on here, really trying to survive. This crowd getting a little restless. They're starting to clap a little bit. They're whistling a little bit. They'd like to see more action, but I don't know if these guys, I can't imagine giving any more than they have. Can you imagine having to fight a final after this? Yeah, whoever it is is in big trouble. I'll tell you that right now. Big, big trouble against Nick Nutter. He seemed, I mean, Nick Nutter actually had a very di difficult time with Joe Charles as well. So it's not going to be easy for him. But he's been resting now for about 45 minutes. Right. And I think they're going to give it a 30-minute break uh, or possibly... In the last fights, they were just doing 10 or 15 minutes. I think Bob Chunchin's people will try and push for an extra 15 minutes there to give their their guy uh, a chance, or Semenov's people, depending on who goes on to the finals. Is there a possibility of the second alternate coming in if these guys are too banged up? Very possibly. Although, actually, we uh, did we have a second alternate? I believe both of those fighters were hurt too. So I don't know if we have another alternate. Five. Okay, this is down to the last three seconds. Two, one, it's over. The overtime is over. This will definitely go back to the to the judges. We will have a winner. Yeah, there's got to be a winner at this point because the, someone's got to go on to fight Nick Nutter. No free rides here in Israel. You don't just get a victory. You could look at the bloody face of Bob Chancho. We don't know who actually, whose blood is bloodier whose face is bloodier <laughs> because they were bleeding all over each other. Bob Chanchin being on the bottom. Bob Chanchin has a nasty gash over his left eye, Greg. And, and, uh, and uh, Semenov has one right in the middle of his forehead. Yeah. So hopefully one of these guys will be able to continue. Well, I, I, would, I would not want to be a judge for this fight. Nor I. No right. It's much too close to call. I'll tell you, I, I'll be honest with you, I think maybe Simonov pulled this, pulled this one out with that last flurry kind of dominated in the overtime. Yeah, you know what? It's If you started early on, it was really Bob Chunchin. Semenov really came on at the end. Uh, it's really too tough to call. 
I, I, I would not want to be, you're right, I would not want to uh, be the judge in this one. I would like, frankly, probably to see it go to another overtime, but it would just be totally unfair for whoever then to fight Nick Nutter. So we shall see. But one judge just went with Vuff Chenchen. Doctors are looking at his eye. They're looking to see whose blood that is. Yeah. And his body is bathed in blood. Yeah. You can see stains all over him. Now they'll take a look at Semenov. I don't know what that has to do with the decision, but. I have no idea either, but one of these guys is going to fight Nick Nutter. <laughs> in the championship fight. I'll tell you, that was as rugged and uh, manly a battle as you'll ever see. Two men refusing to give in. Two guys that uh, don't know what quit means. Yeah, very evenly matched fighters. Great match matchmaking here tonight to come up with a final like the last two fights we've seen. Some nice swelling there. We're looking at the hand. The left hand appears to be broken of Semenov is what they're telling us now. I'm not sure, maybe his wrist? I think they're telling us it's his wrist. His left hand or wrist appears to be broken. Boy, your Russian's a lot better than mine. I thought he had a finger problem. Yeah, I believe it's the wrist. Maybe that whole hand. Yeah. Well, it's in the hands of those gentlemen right there as they discuss okay. who it is. Okay. Let's listen in. There he is, your champion. A very dejected Alex Semenov standing there going, I can't believe this. Two great warriors battle. And in overtime, Igor Vavchenkin wins it and will face Nick Nutter in the final. Boy, has he got a tough tough night ahead of him. We're still just getting to the final match. A great, great semi-final match. And boy, I just, I just, I, I feel for the guy. I can't even picture going in after another fight like that. I mean, he's already been in the, he's already fought over one hour tonight in the ring. And now he's got to go fight a guy like Nick Nutter.